This is James Holder for IFL TV. I'm in the Pro SW Gym State in Loughton. With me, I've got Philip Bowers. How are we doing, Philip? I'm good, you know, bro. How are you doing? I'm all right, brother. I'm all right. First and foremost, it's good to catch up with you. Thanks for giving me a little bit of time today. And that. No problem, no problem. Yeah, we're, we're here there talking about your Masters fight coming up, your International Masters fight. Yeah, next week, Saturday, um, I'm fighting for the International Masters title. Who like, are you what fighting? Are we? A guy called um, Francis Maynard. Okay. I don't know nothing about him really. Af African fighter, isn't African he? fighter, yeah. I think he's British based, obviously. Um, you know, I heard he's meant to be strong, but you know, Francis Main is not really the um, the pride, the prize of the title. So he's just the, you know, the guy that I'm, I've got, I've been matched against, and um, I'll just do my job come Saturday night. Eight and zero, chance yeah. to win your first professional title. Yeah, yeah, yeah. How are you feeling right now? You know, I feel, I feel good, man. I feel like a, I feel like a million pounds. I can't say a million dollars because. My currency is pounds, not dollars, you know. But yeah. Yeah, I feel good, man. I feel good. You know, I'm um, training's going well, sparring's going well. You know, good preparation. You know, it's all good. I know you've recently been, been sparring with Diego Burton. Yeah. Quite a similar makeup, would you say, to Francis? Quite a similar kind of style. You know what? I don't know, because as I said, I haven't really seen much of Francis. I mean, I haven't really seen no tapes or anything. I mean, I just let my team do, you know, most of the. Um, What's it called research or homework? I mean, I haven't seen anything about on Francis at all. But I mean, Diego Burton, you know, like people don't really give him credit, but he's a good, very, very good fighter, very good technician. He's like he's like a throwback fighter. He's like from the 1950s, you know, that got that old kind of veteran style. You know what I mean? And yeah, he's been good sparring for me. You know what I mean? I've, I've been sparring other people, but he's my, my main sparring partner at the present moment. Mm -hmm. You're fighting on a Steve Goodwin bill, or is it a Josh Goodwin bill? That's an interesting. You know what? Yeah, I don't even know both of them. I'm I'm with the Goodwin family, so whoever are promoting the show, I'm finding that show. So it could be Goodwin, it could be Steve, it could be Josh, it could be Olivia, whoever it is. I'm just happy to be a part of the show. How are you finding life being promoted by the Goodwin family? You know what? They're a great family. You know what I mean? Like they look after me, they get me the fights, they keep me busy. Um, I'm fighting regular, you know what I mean? So, to be honest with you, I'm just happy to just be on the show. They promote, promote me well, you know what I mean? They look after me when they can, and that's just the bottom line. Do you know what I want to talk to you about? You yeah. You tell me this before. Your, your brother is actually an IFL TV icon, isn't he? Oh, <laughs> yeah, yeah. Not many people know this, but nah, nah. Ozzy B's actually your brother. We've had yeah. Ozzy B's been supporting IFL TV from the very start. Yeah, yeah, he's my We've brother. Talks and talks of him during riots and yeah. other things, and had his, his viewpoints on quite a, quite yeah, a lot yeah, of yeah. stuff. So yeah. It's good to get you on the channel knowing that. Yeah, well. man, he's my brother, yeah, man, you know what I mean? He's my brother, like, my dad's son, you know what I mean? So, yeah, he's, he's cool, you know what I mean? Yeah, nice one, is he, mate? Appreciate <laughs> yeah. that. Appreciate that. If you were a boxer, what would you be doing? But, um, you know what? That's a good question. I don't really know what I'll be doing, you know what I mean? I might be a preacher. No, I'm joking. Um, I don't know. I, I, I'll be in, I think I'll be involved in some kind of combat sport. If I wasn't a boxer, I might be, okay. you know, Karate, I've done a lot of karate when I was younger. And then Wing Chun. So you come from kind of a martial arts Yeah, martial arts background. background. Well. So I've done Taekwondo, Kaioka Shinkai, Karate, I've done Wing Chun. So it'll be any of, I could, I'd be, I'd definitely be a martial artist, I suppose. Mm -hmm. yeah. How much do you live the boxing life away from, away from the boxing gym, away from the pressure, away from your coaches? How, how, how much do you stay in shape? You know, I stay in shape, I stay in um, pretty much good shape, really and truly. I don't drink, I don't smoke, you know what I mean? I mean, um, I'm like Samson, women's my only downfall, you know what I mean? <laughs> <laughs> no, but um, no, um, being real, no, I, I keep in good shape, you know what I mean? Um, I don't drink a lot of smoke, I probably go up about six, seven kilos between fights, so not too bad, you know what I mean? So yeah, I live the life pretty much, you know what I mean? All I do is really study boxing tapes, you know what I mean? Be with my family, and um, yeah, basically just be humble. You spoke about Diego Burton being a bit of a throwback fight today. What throwback fights from the past would you say I've been relevant in your style, and who who do you like kind of watch? Well, to me, you know, my 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 icons or my um, you know, fighters that I look up to is definitely Pernell Whitaker and Floyd Mayweather. You know what I mean? Okay. I mean, I like per, um, Pernell Whitaker's, you know, his shimmies, his little dips and stuff. You know what I mean? I like Mayweather only obviously because of his you know defense. So that like, if you if I'm looking at those two boxing um personalities I can't get no better than that you know. Do you think Mayweather's coming toward the end of his career now? No 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 no. Like, Do you, you agree know, with people that said the age is catching him up? No like I don't, be, I don't agree with that at all. At the end of the day you know Mayweather fought that fight to the best of his ability. At the end of the day Madonna he was coming like you know like a beast you know what I mean? So what, what all Mayweather could do is be like a mad matador and just sidestep him and you know what I mean do what he could do. Mm. He's not coming to the end of his career at all you know what I mean? At the end of the day he already said he's going to do 
you know, five fights for um, Showtime. When those five fights are finished, then he'll be he'll, he'll be um, coming to the end of his career, obviously. Um, talk to me a little bit about the press conference coming up and the date for your fight. Tickets available? Yeah, if tickets are available, they're £35 or £60 for um, ringside. Um, I just got to give a shout out to my trainer, Archie Dublin, um, Tundi Ajayi, you know what I mean? His pad work's phenomenal. I've had him on board, like, you know, from the Port Appleby fight. And, um, you know, like, he's, he's pad work second to none. You know what I mean? I want to big up my sponsors, um, BoxFit, um, my, my good friend, um, designing my website, um, Mimi Designs, Moringa Mutual, you know what I mean? Um, Hammer Nutrition. I mean, yeah, so everything's coming, to, um, coming together. The press conference is um, next week, Wednesday. Um, I don't know where the location is. I think it's somewhere in Finchley. Um, what else can I really tell you? Um, yeah, you know, I'm not really bothered about the press conference and stuff like that. All I want to do is just fight, show people my skills, you know what I mean? And um, just be a force reckon within the um, like, World weight division. 8-0 you know, now, good yeah. chance to showcase your talents. Definitely, definitely. Hopefully you had a Masters title to yeah. your collection. Yeah. So I'm keep, planning to. Keep doing what you're doing, man. Yeah, definitely, man, definitely. And thanks for interviewing me also. You're more than welcome, thanks. Give me a bit of time. <laughs> so James Helder with Philip Bowers for IFL TV. Thank you very much.